Regional anaesthesia is a way of anaesthetising a part of the body for surgery without actually rendering the brain unconscious. And we use local anaesthetics to achieve this. The local anaesthetics need to be given around the nerve or nerves which supply the part of the body which is being operated on. And that could be anything from the arm, the shoulder, the legs or feet, or even the tummy. We use modern techniques to administer regional anaesthesia in exactly the right amount to be exactly the right part of your body. Anil was a man who had a condition which caused thickening and tightening of the tissues in deep in the palm of his hand. So much so that for a couple of his fingers, he, they were fixed, they were bent, he couldn't properly straight them. It curled over a period of 10 years where it got to the stage where I couldn't put a, a golf glove on. The benefits of regional anaesthesia include effective pain control. By anaesthetising a, a part of the body, we have a really good way of controlling the amount of uh, sensation a patient receives as that wears off and we can improve the quality of pain relief after surgery. Other benefits include uh, fewer side effects because we don't need to use as many medications. By completely anaesthetising a part of the body, there's less stimulus to the rest of the body in terms of stress and that can have benefits with respect to heart function and it may also have benefits with respect to the immune function and there is some evidence that the use of regional anaesthesia is associated with a decreased likelihood of having chronic pain after surgery. David just kept reassuring me. He just made me feel so relaxed and I was surprised when the surgeon said the operation was over. Once you've had your procedure under regional anaesthesia, you go out to the recovery area and you very quickly can go off home or up to the ward for your further care and recovery. To be honest, it was just like having a flu vaccination.